How much have you learned from Masters of Sex? Oh my gosh, you know, right now I have on my bedside table the book that our show was based on by Thomas Mayer, um, an acting book that I love, and my Bible. So I've been really studying, studying my Masters and Johnson, and I think what's so beautiful that they did is they changed kind of the soundscape and the conversation of sex through their work so that they so quietly created in the 1950s and then got to share with everybody in the 60s. It's a wonderful show, very unique, very successful. Why do you think it's uh, so uh, the reviewers are going crazy and they all love it? I think that, uh, yes, it's about sex, but it's, a, it's about humans and about the human condition. And I also think that it's so interesting to watch this topic in an era that, w that it, this topic was so taboo in. Um, but most of all, the characters are beautiful and interesting and real and human and authentic. And that's what, I think that's what people like to watch. When it comes to a weekly, weekly show, how important is it to develop that friendship with all the other actors? I mean, you've been together for a long time, right? Yes, you know, we spend so much time together that I, I, I'm so grateful that that's a part of of uh, creating television because I think it's you know intrinsic to the relationship that you have and the chemistry that you have. It's great to be friends with the people that you work with.